yeah, back. We're immediately back. We're racing. We're going. We're going. Are, you, are there other people? Or there's other people. They're all. Oh like, god. I, I truly thought, are you in a car and they're all on motorcycles? That doesn't feel safe. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, no, there are other people in cars. And then I'm like, well, that still doesn't seem super safe. For, like, you know, them. Like, right? Am I crazy? Wee, no. And that's like a fucking. What is that? It's that's a, a helmet. You're on a, you're on a Porsche. Yeah. Porsches were really good at um, rally racing. Over, over, over scrub? Possibly. <laughs> It's really racing, you're just racing over harsh terrain. Mm. Now that felt a um, proper weighted. That did. That's interesting. Unless you got a just separate physics for it. Mm. It feels like a game that would have like specialized physics for each. Race type? Yep. Mm. Maybe. But also that feels really shitty. I don't know, many games do do that. What? Like what? If you see post Pro Street, yeah, that was old. Yeah. Ancient. What modern games do that? Because that's just like, oh, I got used to this physics engine, and now I'm playing a different kind of race, and the physics engine has changed. So all of the things I press will be wrong. What do you think we could bring that up, actually? Like, um, all the, fir the first three Crash Bandicoots that were ever made, they have all s three separate types of physics engines. Yeah. So Oof. when the, um,. Um, the, the remaster. remaster came out. They all used one engine, and that was based on the third game. Mm. So it made the first game easier. The second game barely playable, mm. and the third one easy as pie. That's very interesting. Mm. Especially that they didn't like account for that. Yeah, and it was like I was wondering why I kept like failing at the second game when it was like my favourite on the um, original PlayStation, which I absolutely dominated. Yeah. 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 We never finished playing that, did we? Nah. You just kind of gave up. Well, we got up to the higher rod and I just stopped pulling my hair out. Yeah. Then we forgot about it. Mm -hmm. We did the, fir uh, the third game from front to back. In a session. Really? Yeah. Because it took about, like, what, three for the first game? Wow. So we did first and third. Yeah. But not second. No. Oh. That would be just pain. Fair enough. That is interesting to me that they standardize the physics. Because, like, I mean, they would. That, that's a totally reasonable option. But they didn't, like, revisit the levels and tweak some stuff. Nah. Like, that's, that's interesting. Because there's some super tight jumps that just do not work. Like, you have to, like, do advanced trigonometry to find, um, to figure out. Yeah. Wild. I think, because they did, like, the remake of the Spyros, I don't, but I think they had the same physics. Yeah. Well, the whole lot. That's wild. What did the, the Crash Bandicoot games, like, originally come out on? The, the first three, what did they all come out on? PlayStation. Well, well, no, like, what specific console? One. They all came out on the same one? PlayStation 1, yeah. And they all had different physics engines? Yes. That's insane. Yeah. That is actually it is a munted thing to think about. That's actually nonsensical. Second game was the best. Well, in my opinion. Like, everyone likes the third one because you get the bazooka and the different power-ups, but I think the level variation was a lot more interesting in the second game. Oh, yeah. They're all classics. Yeah. Five by five. Your wings. Five by five. Huh. I was wondering, like, what the hell are you about, about Perkins? It's, um, it's an old, I think, British, like, air thing. Like, um, they already are into if someone's okay, they'd say 5x5. Five five. It means all as well. Uh, it's one of those things where, like, no one is quite sure how it started. Uh, I got you. It's definitely not used anymore. It was, like, a 20th century thing. Yeah. Flying high up to the sky. The air's getting thin. Blobbity peppity poop. Mm. Wee! I use nose to climb higher. Why? And my brain exploded. It's over there. Hmm. La 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 If 
if you turn into a car right now. Yep. Can you like nitrous boost and then it recharges and then nitrous boost? Or do you have to like Can you boost right now? Yeah, I'm boosting. Oh. Huh. Nitrous power. Back to plane. Whee. Is that where you're going? Nah, I'm following that yellow thing. Yellow line. Sort of thing. Suddenly, boat. Boat. <laughs> Please don't sing that. Do you know what song that was a cover of? No. Neither do I, I want to rock. What? Probably I want to rock. I want to rock. No, it's going to be a different tune. It was a rap song, I think. Oh, oh blown bagel. Fucking. I already got this. Why don't I just use mine? That's souped up. Stop giving me shit. And I didn't change a fucking difficulty again. <laughs> we are the best. Yeah, let's just keep on this like super easy and just it's be like, we're learners. It's not our problem, bitch. I want. So this is an online option. Hmm. Like you can play against people online, yeah. obviously. But I don't want to. Yeah. Totally. Because people are awesome. I like because we both own this game. Yeah. And we played against each other. Uh, would it would be a hot mess? No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, you'd crush me. But uh, my question is, um, mm. the question I'm trying to get to is, if I I would have it on very easy. Yes. And you would have it on like medium or hard. Yeah. And if we played against each other on this, um, does it like does that not apply because we're both human? Yep. Okay. It's only to the KPU. So it's not like, I have an easy difficulty, my wheels are a little better at traction. Nothing like that. Yeah. Well, you might have, like, better, um, aids. Huh? Better aids. Cool. Like, traction control, better, um, stability program or something like that. Hmm. Because I know if you put it on, like, super hard mode, you just get everything, like, taken off. So it's, like, no assists. Interesting. Piss off. No, this is my house. No, I'm talking to them. Who shit in your pancakes? I don't know. But Who pissed in your cereal? They left DNA evidence. Ugh. Because that's it. That's in poop. <laughs> they can find you. What type of cereal is this? It's a fiber chunk. <sighs> the food. Da 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 Toing. Uh, apparently, haven't I've heard this down like through word of mouth that Rocco's modern life has either been rebooted or is going to be rebooted. I have also heard that. Uh, I think it's going to be a Netflix show. Okay. Let me check that. Um. Um. Netflix. Initial release, 9th of August, 2019. Well, a long time ago. Static Cling is the subtitle. Uh, oh, it's 45 minute. It's like a movie? Uh, made for TV movie thing. Hmm. Or disguised pilot. That's interesting. Might look it up. It was like a six, I think it was like a 60% 60s. Mm -hmm. Rotten Tomatoes. Okay. So I don't think it was super popular. No. I want to watch the reboot of Animaniacs. I don't think they can be as um, creative as, as they once were. Mm. Just with everything getting soft. Who was that? Warner Brothers? Yeah. Mm. Because they were known as the Warner Brothers. And Dot. Mm. That's interesting. I can't really think of any kids programs they've done in a long time. Yeah. So I don't know like how much they'd let you get away with. Isn't it Yakko and Wacko Warner? I don't know. I don't watch a lot of kid stuff. Oh, it was awesome. It was more adult humour hmm. in a kid show. I think Wacko's just been doing practicing proctology. My bottom hurts!
Huh. It's weird. Yeah, like, one of them just had a British accent for no reason. Sure. Hmm. Cops. Hmm. Must be racing too fast on the streets. Hmm. There should be something done about that. That, um... That street up there, the long one that connects to... Yeah. Wait, what direction is it in? That way? Yeah. You know, the one with the IGA and it connects to... Yeah. Um, he used to do drag races on that. That's why there's a big, like, divot in the road now. So they stop him? Yeah. That's not really a place I would do drag racing, really. Okay, it's just because it's straight <laughs> and long. The one thing I want to do is the massive fucking straight one when you get out of the road. When it go The one that leads up to the main um, intersection. Because that's a dead straight. You mean on the main road? Yeah. No. Well, they'd never be able to get away with that. It's too visible. Mm -hmm. No, if you go that's fast enough. Well, then you, you can outrun the cop cars, but you can't outrun the, outrun the cop radio. Mm. That is a bit of a pain in the arseros. Do like that effect. Copperhead Road. I think this one's a model after my dad's Porsche. No. Oh yeah, your dad has a Porsche. Yep. You ever take it out? Not anymore. Mm. We really need to get that fixed. I used to love driving that thing. Slowest car we own, but yeah, beautiful huh. to drive. Yeah. What model is it? It's it a, not... is a Carrera. Like the marble. Carrera Marble. Ah! You distracted me. But no matter, we're there. Sort of. Overshot. Get all up. Not about it, yucks. Going back to them. Porsche 911. Do you know what the bad thing about being rich is? Your only other nickname is Dick? Ugh. <laughs> uh. Give me the bird. We'd love to, but the sentence is one lowered. That was Animaniacs. Yes. Never watched it, but just know how they talk. Don't know how I know that, I just do. <laughs> Don't know where I got these electricity superpowers, just have them. <laughs> <laughs> Red. Teal. I do like teal as a color. Oi, piss off. It's a perfectly orange. Oh, my favorite color, chartreuse. Hmm. Chartreuse is also a good one. It used to be red, but everyone likes red, so I chose chartreuse. I, um... I mean, it depends on what the thing is. Uh, for clothes, I tend towards either very light or very bright colors. Yeah. Um, if I were, like, painting the inside of my house to live in, I'd have a lot of browns and forest greens. I do like walnut as a color. Oh yeah. Walnut is a nice color. I like the look of log cabins. They look so cozy. Yeah, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, I was always thinking for, like, an idea I'm like, I wanted to put in my comics, but then I just lost the urge to make them was, um, at Christmas time, getting, like, like, fake log rolls to put on your, like, um, walls, like, decoration. Oh, yeah. To make it look like a log cabin. I have, um... I sleep during the day. Mm-hmm. So I have, um, the TV on yep. while I sleep. Just, like, not on loud, but, like, I just play The Big Bang Theory. Yep. Or Brooklyn Nine-Nine, or just, like, the kind of shit you don't have to watch. Yeah. So just shoot out of. Yeah, so I just use it as white noise, basically. Yeah. But um, I know that there's a a couple of different uh, Christmas fire oh, yeah. videos, and I'm thinking of using one of them. Classified as ASMR. Yeah. What does it, Netflix has one? One of my favorite ones to use. It's um, thunderstorm in the cabin. Oh. It's just you hear the pitter patter on the roof, roll of distant thunder, and just like a little calming, like breeze, not like wind, yeah. whistle, and it's just like, oh 
God, yes. Bang. Fireplace for your home. Fireplace for your home classic edition. Fireplace for your home Birchwood edition. The what? Witcher fireplace. Those are the the four options. Um, the Witcher one is 59 minutes. Birchwood is an hour. Fireplace for your home. Oh, there's three different ones. Fireplace for your home is Crackling Yule Log Fireplace, Crackling Fireplace, and Crackling Fireplace with music. They're all an hour long. Okay. Uh, fireplace 4K. Wow, extravagant. Is, that's the, um, yeah. One that's thing I would are. love to have in a house. A proper log fire. Yep. We used to have one in our house, and the first thing we did when we threw it out was regretted it instantly. Mm. God, there's so many different Witcher things. Look at all this shit. Wow. Wow! Where are we going now? Mm. Far away again. Oh, how far? Three kilometers away. Hmm. Whee! That's not that far. No. Okay. You see what I see, don't you? A uh, big thing to fly through. And to accidentally clip the spiral and make it pop and tangle around you when you crash and burn. No, you're not being hopeful. To the left there. Is that it? That yellow dot? Yep. La, 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 la. At least I hope it is. I don't understand. Gonna be high. That's not it. That's not it. Oh, hi. Wanna be free to know the things I do. All right. Hey. Am I gonna make it through this? Oh. Ah, ghost. Oh, go get you. Ghost place. Oh. <laughs> I hate how it flashes. Yeah. What? <laughs> oh, hey! It worked. <coughs> oh, God. You can't prove it didn't. Uh, We've got a time limit. Can we make it in the time limit? I don't know. Is it a sprint or. I don't know, Dave. It'll be over. <laughs> like, Quick. No, I don't have any drags. Yes. Oh, we'll go drag racing next episode. Yeah. While I have my energy drunk. I do like Porsches. Really do. What if I should have an energy drink? I wonder how cheap Caymans are going for these days. What? Cayman. It's a model of Porsche. Oh. It's a mid-engine Porsche. They had to dull them down after the first um, generation because they were beating the top um, top end ones. Huh? Because they were more balanced. Nah. Uh, balanced in what sense? Like it was. Um, like well, weight the, distribution. Yeah, weight distribution was a lot better. Oh, okay. Because in these Porsches, the engine is right at the back. Yeah. So, so if you grab a hammer by the handle and dangle it upside down and start swinging it, that's like roughly the effect you get with rear engine cars. Hmm. Whereas if you like grab the hammer by the actual head bit of it and start jiggling it, hmm. it's a lot more balanced. That explanation mm -hmm. made truly no sense to me. It did. Uh, no, like my brain was like, why are you talking about hammers? Well, uh, like I mean, okay, I, I, I feel like I... <laughs> knew more before you started talking. What? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so this one, this yes. model, engine's right at the back. Yes. Hop so it at the back. Accelerate too hard, front comes up a bit. Nah. No? You spin off the roll backwards and you die. Huh. I guess I don't understand the physics of that, but I will take your word on it. Like all the weights in the back. Well, yeah, I, I know that. Mm -hmm. I just don't know why that causes it spin. Centrifugal force, my friend. Centripetal. But also, like, it's not... 
It's also not what centripetal force is. I just, I feel like I don't understand. I, I don't think you're wrong, for the record. Mm. I'm, you know more about cars than me. Yeah. That fact is written into my soul. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but like, I just, I can't pass why that would lead to that. Like it, like it coming, you're going so fast that it kind of mm. goes, that makes yeah. sense to me. Uh, going so fast that it starts to spin. Yeah. Because like the wheels move at the same speed, right? Yeah. The 911 Turbo, the first edition, was known as the Widowmaker. Because the Turbo used to come up without much force. It just used to, like, if you weren't, like, ready for it, you could just spin the car. Wow. Mm. Woo! That's a while. It's a German. Push. Yeah. Good. Oh, I can't do a good German right now. I thought you were just about to say Gulag. No, I was going to say Guten Tag. Guten Tag. Guten Tag! Gulag's a Russian. Yeah, that's why we got confused. Oh, okay. To the Gulag! Lots of green stuff. We'll go around time. Radio! My bit. Bye. Bye.